Warren Gatland equals Alan Davies record of 35 games in charge of Wales today and he'll be happy with this start and Mirko Bergamasco will be happy with that tackle he's flattened Lee Byrne Wales retain the ball though Mike Phillips to Jones and Wales look to spread wide and there's a loose ball which Italy have picked up and it's a little kick on by Gonzalo Canale and he looks like he's got the pace he's picked the mismatch against Bradley Davis that's some five minutes gone and the Italian crowd are on their feet and here's why Morgan Stoggard couldn't control the ball and it allowed Gonzalo Canale to kick through and he's in for his sixth try for Italy and they lead 5-3 here's James Hook he's found his way through and he's made the offload to Lee Byrne and Byrne's found Morgan Stoggard who should score and he could have been held up some last gasp Italian defending James Hook really showing the form that he had last week. Picked the mismatch against uh, Gonzalo Canale. Finding Byrne who offloaded and does he get it down? Yes, and we'll see from this angle that Morgan Stoggard has his second try of the RBS Six Nations. Enthralling start to this match then, 16 points in under 15 minutes. Semenzato's kick a little bit too long and Shane Williams will look to attack and he does that's Lee Byrne inside and he finds Hook and Hook steps inside and Sam Warburton will score his first try for Wales referee playing the advantage and Italy will try and take it Burton decides to come left and meets a wall of Welsh defenders Barbieri is the temporary scrum half and he finds Zani and Bergamasco Italy on the five now Semenzato picks up and they try and shove him over the line. It's right into the corner flag. And Italy go once more. This time with Zani. He's crossed the threshold, but has he managed to get the ball down? From this angle, we can't see. And Morgan Stoggard looks like he's held it up. And yes, he has. Wales still with the seven point advantage then but the referee will go back for the penalty Bergamasco to reduce the deficit to four then comfortably through the middle for Bergamasco Italy had worked so hard to keep the score so close and they'll want to make sure that they can just see out this first half now and Hook goes and he's tackled by Barbieri all the Italian players desperately trying not to give away a penalty and Stephen Jones sees Wales to a 10-point lead at half-time Wales are looking for a second successive away win Italy have won two of their five RBS Six Nations encounters with Wales in Rome both of them in World Cup years is that an omen today it's Shane Williams with the sloppy pass in the boot of Barbiero kicking the ball on and Italy can chase Williams redeems himself but Bergen Masco who's having a fiery game he's everywhere he secured the ball Fabio Semenzato goes left to Sergio Parisi and he's pushed his way over the line Stephen Jones just can't handle the strength of the Italian captain who goes in in the corner after 50 minutes this first 10 minutes of Italian pressure being rewarded with a try that's reduced the deficit to five. Wales have forced their way into the 22. Shane Williams having to tidy it up and Jamie Roberts barges his way into the 22 once more. And this could be an opportunity for Wales to take the game out of Italy's reach. Phillips signals to the right, but behind him, Hook and Jones both wait for the drop goal. Phillips decides to shove it on one more time. And finally, the time is right to go to James Hook. And is that the drop goal that wins Wales this game? The advantage is eight. Less than four minutes on the match clock, and Italy must score here. Canavasio, Scarby, and Okera with the wide pass. Canale takes it on with Bergamasco outside him, but Morgan Stoggard has made a super tackle there. And Canale kicks the boards. 
and if Italy had only kicked some of their goals, this game could have been different. It was a lovely move. Canale exploiting the gap in the Welsh midfield, but Bergamasco couldn't get free. And Wales will have their second successive win in this RBS Six Nations. And Italy will rue their missed opportunities today. Mike Phillips will try and run down the clock. Ryan Jones picks up. The ball's knocked on, but that will be the last play of the game. And Wales have won at the Stadio Flaminio. Opportunities for Italy. But in the end, Wales just holding on. 24 points to 16.